In China, Lao Security Investment stands for dynamic new growth. A joint Chinese venture with Wayne Enterprises will be a powerhouse. Well, Mr. Lao, I speak for the rest of the board and Mr. Wayne in expressing our own excitement. Look at you. What do you believe in, huh? What do you believe in? I believe whatever doesn't kill you simply makes you a stranger. I know the squealers when I see them. And what do you propose? It's simple. We uh, kill the Batman. <laughs> if it's so simple, why haven't you done it already? If you're good at something, never do it for free. How much you want? Uh, half. Be aware, the image is disturbing. Tell them your name. Ryan. <laughs> Are you the real Batman? No. 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 <laughs> then why do you dress up like him? <laughs> He's a symbol. That we don't have to be afraid of scum like you. Yeah. You do, Brian. You really do. Huh? Yeah. Oh, shh, 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 shh. So you think Batman's made Gotham a better place? Hmm? Yeah. Look at me. Look at me! You see, this is how crazy Batman's made Gotham. You want order in Gotham. Batman must take off his mask and turn himself in. Oh, and every day he doesn't, people will die. Starting tonight. I'm a man of my word. <laughs> <laughs> Harvey may not know you well enough to understand when you're making fun of him, but I do. No, I'm in every word. You know that day that you once told me about when Gotham would no longer need Batman? It's coming. You can't ask me to wait for that. It's happening now. Harvey is that hero. He locked up half of the city's criminals, and he did it without wearing a mask. Gotham needs a hero with a face. Joker killed Gordon. He's gonna kill Rachel. You're the symbol of hope. I can never be. Your stand against organized crime is the first legitimate ray of light in Gotham in decades. If anyone saw this, everything would be undone. All the criminals you pulled off the streets would be released, and Jim Gordon will have died for nothing. You're gonna hold a press conference tomorrow morning. Why? No one else will die because of me. Gotham's in your hands now. You can't. You can't give in. You can't give in! Locked as well? Everything. Anything that could lead back to Lucius or Rachel. <laughs> People are dying, Alfred. What would you have me do? Endure, Master Wayne. Take it. They'll hate you for it, but that's the point of Batman. He can be the outcast. He can make the choice that no one else can make. The right choice. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming. I've called this press conference for two reasons. Firstly, to assure the citizens of Gotham that everything that can be done over the Joker killings is being done. Secondly, because the Batman is offered to turn himself in. But first, let's consider the situation. Should we give in to this terrorist demands? Do we really think We'd that he's going to protect an outlaw vigilante than the lives of citizens? The Batman is an outlaw. But that's not why we're demanding he turn himself in. We're doing it because we're scared. We've been happy to let the Batman clean up our streets for us until now. Things are worse than ever. Amen. Yes, they are. The night is darkest just before the dawn. And I promise you, the dawn is coming. One day, the Batman will have to answer for the laws he's broken. But to us, not to this madman. 
No more dead cops! Yeah. Yeah. You should burn them, South Bay! Get us out of here! Take the Batman into custody. I am the Batman. Come on.